Hi guys, it's me Taylor and welcome back to five favorite features. Normally when we pick these vehicles, we pick ones that we know a little information about, but today I picked the 2020 GMC Terrain, which I know absolutely nothing about. So let's go get a salesperson to help us learn more about this vehicle. All right guys, so we're here with John, who's gonna take us through some of the features. What's the first one you got here for us? We're gonna start back here with the trunk. Well, pretty versatile, roomier than you would expect. Oh, you wow. have the room here with your seats up. The nice thing is you have a little storage area under here that you can put some stuff in here, you know, groceries or whatever that you don't want sliding around. Put them in there, you have a little tab to pull that back, close that up. If you needed some extra room, you have on this side of, the, you have your handles here that you would just Oh wow, that's a lot of space. Back, folds down those seats, gives you a little bit more room, and then a little extra. Anything up to eight feet, if you fold this front seat down completely, you can put something up to eight feet. Huh. So our next favorite feature is? GMC's Precision Shifter. So you have your buttons here instead of your typical shifter. A mm -hmm. um, couple different things that that does there for you. Opens this up, you have your cup holders yeah, side by side there. instead of one in front of the other. The other thing that it does is it makes it hard to go into a wrong gear. Foot on the brake, just pull towards you. It lights up, lets you know what gear you're in. Reverse, same thing. You're gonna get that along with your backup camera. My first impression when I saw these is I would think it wouldn't be as safe because I've just used them as buttons, but they're actually safer. Right, yeah, because again, like I said, if your mm -hmm. foot's not on there, you push it, it basically yells at you and says, hey, dummy, put yeah. your foot on the brake or we're not going anywhere. So our next favorite feature. The all-wheel drive. Under normal driving circumstances, drive around in front-wheel drive. That paired with the auto stop-start feature saves you big mm -hmm. gas mileage. But if you need the all-wheel drive, you're just gonna turn the switch. It stops once this light stops flashing. It says AWD, you're in all-wheel drive. You have another feature here that's kind of like an off-road, so that would be for snow, ice, mud, anything like that. And it just kind of locks up the wheels a little bit more. So this is actually one of my favorite features that I know about this car is the remote it's start. remote start. I don't have very... a garage, so I'm... I would be super excited about that. Yes, it comes in very handy. The other nice thing is, is it pairs right along with the app that you can download on the phone. So oh. if you happen to be at work and you're nowhere close to the vehicle, it's cold, snowing, anything like that, pull out your app, hit the button, remote start the car from anywhere. And when you get there, it's running and warmed up for mm -hmm. you. Um, but if you do use the key fob, very easy to use. On the key fob itself, you're gonna hit the lock button one time. You're gonna watch for the lights to flash. Mm -hmm. Then you're gonna push and hold this little circular button. Again, watch for the lights to flash. Once they come on, car's running. Hmm. It's gonna run like this for about 10 minutes. If you're not in it and hit the button to start it, it will shut itself off. You can do that another time. Mm -hmm. So two back to back. And then after that, you have to physically get in and start up uh, the car. Okay. One of my favorite features that they have added now and made standard across all of the terrains, whether you're in a base front wheel drive or top of the line Denali, uh, they have added the driver confidence package, which is nice safety features. It's gonna give you forward collision alert. You're going to get lane keep assist with lane departure warning. You're also gonna get your IntelliBeam headlights. So your forward collision, depending on how fast you drive and how far you have that distance set out. We'll just warn you visually by right up here on the dashboard, you see a little cutout. Mm -hmm. It's gonna flash little red lights that'll reflect on the windshield. Oh, so you Alert can see you it. to if you're oh. getting too close to the car in front of you, depending on how fast you're going. The lane keep assist, another nice thing. If you're driving down the road, maybe you reach over to grab something and start to drift either to the left or to the right camera is going to track as long as it can pick up the lines in the road. If you start to drift over, it's going to actually turn the steering wheel and push you back into the lane, either left or right. It's more of a subtle drifting mm -hmm. from one Just side to like the other. Kind of like ease you back in. Yes. All right, guys. So there you have it. Those are some really cool features on the 2020 GMC Terrain. I hope you guys learned a lot because I know I sure did. But if you have any further questions, go ahead and comment down below. 
because I'll be the one answering and we can figure them out together. Or better yet, stop in off Route 30 in Greensburg and come visit us or go to our website, smailbuickgmc.com. See you next time.